Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. If you're new, my name is Michelle and I'm currently on a journey to get out of $50,000 worth of debt. Here on my channel, I post a new video every single Sunday on budgeting, lifestyle, motherhood, and I also am on a journey to lose 65 pounds and I post my weight loss journey every single Wednesday. So if that sounds like something that you might be interested in, please go ahead and subscribe so you don't miss when I post a new video. So yes, I do post my actual personal budget with real numbers every single month. And so today we're going to be doing June's budget report. So let's go ahead and get into the video and see how we did for the month of June. Okay, so now to see how June's budget went. So my starting balance, I budgeted for negative $15 and it was negative $15. My first check I budgeted for $1,116, which that's what it was. I did this after I got paid. But for check two, I budgeted $1,100 and it was and it was actually 11, oops, 11, 18. And the money Roger gave me was 400. So my total income for the month of June was $2,619. So it was like $18 more than I had budgeted for. I do round all of these numbers to the nearest dollar. So for my income, say this check was 11, 16 with like 50 cents at the end of it. Um, I'm just gonna take off that 50 cents and round it down to the nearest dollar. So it's a lower amount um, But for expenses like my water payment is like 88.80 every single month and I will just round that up. So um, Just because the whole number is a lot easier for me to deal with and by rounding it up I'm kind of budgeting a little bit more than I need and then rounding this down I have less than I actually have to work with just to be on the safer side I like to do it that way um, just because I don't like to deal with the decimal point but anyway next for my monthly expenses so for my mortgage payment it's always 1364 I was actually late making my payment it took me a little bit longer to get to the bank than I expected it to um, so I didn't deposit the money that he gave me in time and my mortgage payment was late so I did get charged a late fee for that so I ended up spending $1,000 $451, which is why I went negative. If you saw last week's video, um, I did go negative. So that is why my HOA, I did pay $60 and my water payment, I did pay 89 Internet, I did pay 106 And for my maintenance fee, I did pay 20 For Amazon Prime, I did pay 14 Epidemic Sound, I did pay 15 And then my safety cushion, I did pay a dollar. Um, and then so that gave me a total of $1,756 for my, all of my monthly expenses. Um, for my monthly debts, I budgeted $80 and I paid $80 for a total of $80. So next I have my sinking funds. So I budgeted $400 for um, groceries and household and I put all of these into my cube money account. So if you're interested, I can link the video where I talk all about that. Um, but then next I have gas, so I only budgeted $70 for gas, and that's all I used. And then my Christmas fund, $70 for that as well, for a total of $540. Um, next I have other, which was, um, which was investing. So I budgeted to invest $312, and that is what I did for a total of $312. So now to make this a zero based budget, which it wasn't exactly this month, um, I'm going to take my total expenses minus my total monthly, or no, sorry, I'm going to take my total income minus my total monthly expenses, minus my debts, minus my sinking funds, minus my other, and I have a total of negative $69. <laughs> so not exactly the zero based budget that I had planned. But life happens and you just got to work with it. Alrighty, well that was June's budget report. So thank you guys so much for watching. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. I do post these videos every single month. So don't forget to subscribe and I will see you guys next time. Bye.